With the release of Pokemon Legends Arceus came new shiny hunting methods, and you can find a lot of shiny Pokemon, and I mean a lot. So, I decided to put them to the test, and I started with the massive mass outbreak method. I did 50 massive mass outbreaks to try and find as many shiny Pokemon as possible, and with the shiny charm, my odds were about 1 in 241 for each Pokemon. But with every challenge, you need some rules, so here were mine. I could only catch shiny Pokemon, so I could only see the original 4 Pokemon of each outbreak. I was still allowed to catch random wild shinies, because they pop up when moving between different outbreaks, and I was limited to only 50 massive outbreaks, no more, no less. So with the rules sorted, my hunt was underway. So after three shinies in the first 10 outbreaks, and a quick visit to Jubilife to check out my shinies, it was time to keep hunting. Sixteen MMOs in, and four shinies later, my luck was feeling pretty good, but it was nothing compared to the run of luck I was about to have.
but after such a good run, I was bound to exhaust my luck. And for the first time in the challenge, I have my first shiny drought. So with the encounters done, it's time for a breakdown. I found 13 shinies in total from 50 MMOs, meaning on average I found one shiny every fourth massive mass outbreak. Those 13 were made up of two wild shinies, which were weirdly both beautifies, and 11 outbreak shinies. I'd say the massive mass outbreak method is a great method if you want a lot of shinies, but not so great if you're hunting a specific Pokemon. But despite that, my hunt felt like a great success, and soon I'll compare it to the regular outbreak method. Thanks for watching.